Parents in the Sparta community are rallying tonight to show support of the school district's mask mandate. This comes after multiple protests against the mandate. News 8 Now's Kate Overton is live in Sparta tonight at that rally. Kate. Over the last few weeks, the Sparta community has been back and forth on a mask mandate that was implemented on September 9th. Now, we've seen a ton of protests against this mask mandate, but tonight we're seeing a mask rally. <coughs> Parents and guardians are here supporting the school board and their decision on to implement a mask, ma mask mandate. And tonight I'm here with one of the parents and one of the organizers of this rally. And Sherry Davenport, why is this rally important to not only the parents but also to the school board? We want to show that we appreciate that the school board listened to all sides of the story. They listened to the experts and they made an informed decision about the mask mandate. We want to show that we support that they chose to mandate the masks. Awesome. And what's your guys' message to the school board? I mean, I know it's part of the mask mandate, but we're here. You guys are here showing support to the school board and their decision. So what, what do you want the school board to know? That we appreciate that they put the health and safety of our children first. Awesome. And from what I've seen, you've seen a lot of support, a lot of people honking in support. What does that mean to you guys who are here holding down the rally, holding up these signs? I think it means that, you know, that we have a lot more support in this community. Um, that, that there's people that agree with us, that the mask mandate is the right thing to do. Thank you, Sherry. Now, currently, as of yesterday, there was 14 active COVID cases across all the Sparta schools and another 67 students and staff in quarantine. And that's the reason why the mask is in place. Mike? All right, thanks a lot, Kate. And parents against the mask mandate did start a recall of two school board members. One of those board members has already resigned, saying he wanted to focus more on his health and his family.